YouTube, what it do? It's your boy, Kid Day, back in the stew, man, and beat, bro. Hey, let me know, bro. I'm finna pull a poll up, bro. Is y'all on Christmas break? Yeah, yeah, nay, bro. Because once I find out y'all on Christmas break, every single day a double upload. I'm not lying. So let me know when y'all get on Christmas break, bro, because I'm ready to drop these bangers back to back to back to back to back. So I'm saying? But y'all see what we got today, bro. We got 600 pound life guest caught lying. Now, I never understood the lion when y'all got, when they got a 4K cameraman recording they every move, bro. How you gonna say you don't know how you gain all this weight? But I got a footage of you eating four Thanksgiving meals in one day. So I'm saying? So, we gonna get to the bottom of this, bro. All that being said, make sure y'all hit that like button and let go ahead and let peep. I want chocolate, I want chocolate, I want chocolate, I want chocolate. <laughs> Beg all you want. I promise you, you ain't eating my chocolate. I'm, you know, hey, this premium cocoa, you can't get this anywhere. I'm just saying. Elbow is a little ashy, too. So, chocolate is more important to you than living, apparently. Hey, what can I say? She addicted to the big black candy bar. Why 600 pounds hey, hey, doesn't I, just test its patient's like resolve that. and commitment, but also their honesty. If you've seen much of the show, then you'll know that it's actually kind of suspenseful to see if and how someone will try and excuse yeah, a bad way in. To be fair, it's weight, probably pretty weight, embarrassing to admit weight, that you aren't sticking to a diet, especially when you're on a TV show but most of these lies just are not that slick, and Dr. Now has heard it all before. Yeah. Anyways, though, as you can she tell by the title, She's shaking like she ain't had a burger in 30 minutes. She got the burger shakes. Today, oh, we'll yo. be talking about a few My 600 Pound Life guests that were caught lying. Before we get started, though, make sure to leave a comment down below. Anyways, let's get started. Number six. 40-year-old Bethany starts off her season 8 Betty, episode by being Betty honest Bob. about her compulsive overeating and her use of food as a crutch for her anxiety. But when Dr. Food. Now questions if her husband no! Sheldon... No! No! Hold on, hold on. Go to the left, bruh. Dog, look at her daughter. Her daughter already in phase one, bruh. Bruh, I hope she won't follow in her mom's footsteps. I know they big steps, but no, she's doomed is the one bringing her food bethany immediately says no yeah. despite the fact that we literally <laughs> bro we see your family meal coming in right now How you just lie? saw his part and her kelly feeding lie? during the camera opening guy, segment camera, of her guy? episode later bethany shows off how well she's oh, been yeah. doing with dieting here she come bro you know it's been 10 years since you picked up a vegetable why are you picking up in front of the camera now shot it like stop tapping on camera, hey, camera, but her next appointment reveals that the results aren't so promising, yeah, like with a only a 14-pound loss. Bethany I mean, doesn't hey, miss a beat some. in claiming that she's sticking to the 1,200 calories and continues to lie about this throughout her entire episode, even when she starts gaining weight again. She only breaks down at the end, telling Dr. Now over video call that the food cravings have been too much before tearfully quitting the program. It was very, very much. And telling Dr. Now over video call that the food cravings have been too much before tearfully quitting the program. It was very, very tragic. Hey, I respect it. I respect it, bro. At least you ain't trying to, you know what I'm saying? Because there's a lot of people that come on here, they keep capping, they keep, you know, she said, hey, I can't do it. You know, hey, I respect it, but at the same time, you could have done it. You know, hey, hey, it's hard to stop eating three combo meals instead of one. Not for everybody, you know? It's not for everybody. But your husband doesn't seem to have a weight problem. No. no he that boy. It's never had a weight problem. That boy's cool. Uh, he got his well, being Does he killed. bring you the unhealthy food? No. Hey, food's here. Okay. Uh. Bro, why she got three drinks? Why, my bro, why husband she really Sheldon comes home on his once? lunch break to bring me my what next meal so I can keep eating. And as much as I want to change, if I'm not getting the tools I need to do that, then I don't see the point. So because of that, I'm ready to tell Dr. Now. I don't plan on continuing hey, with his program. She kept it real with herself. When Dr. Now asks former bypass patient Holly to go through her daily diet, she immediately comes out of the gate with some white lies. She says that she eats breakfast and lunch at home, okay. failing to mention the entire extra meal she claims to have in her intro when she said that right after breakfast, she's often still hungry and goes to- Wait, bro, is she dipping chicken and ice cream, bro? 
Cause please, I'm gonna give you the benefit of the doubt. Tell me that's ranch. Please tell me that ain't ice cream, Shadi. Get takeout food with her fiance Ray. Now it's up to you whether you believe her about her sugar-free jam and the rest of her supposed food for the day. But as Dr. Now points out, it's a lot, but definitely not enough to get someone anywhere near 700 pounds. So. Ain't gonna cap. She, hey, you hiding it good. It's the best looking 700 I done seen for real. I guess Holly is lying. No, lying well, later, <laughs> she's forced to confess to these lies when she only loses 29 pounds of the 50 pound goal that Dr. Now set for her. And some speedy math by Dr. Now reveals that she must have still been eating at least 5,000 to 6,000 calories a day. Last time you only lost uh, 29 pounds in two months instead of 50. I mean, and I gave you a second chance. But now this time you had even less progress with only an 18 pound loss in mm. two months. So you want to tell me why that is? I don't know. I thought I was doing good till I saw the scale. Huh. Vice versa, the scale was doing good until it saw you. <laughs> Ain't gonna lie, Shotty stepped on the scale and he said, please, one person at a time. Head okay. out. Stop playing games you know it's bad and lying to me. You know exactly what you're doing when you're making the choices you do. During Shanae's time in the hospital, the staff had noticed that her husband, Freddie, was sneaking in burgers and pizza. Definitely Why? something that Shanae does not need. And hey, once Dr. Now... No, if the Bro, no, 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 <laughs> you, saw you didn't hide the evidence? How did he, how did, how did he find the whole pizza box? Found out, he immediately confronted the couple. He comes storming into the room with huh. some damning evidence, and though Sinead tries to desperately claim that it was Freddy mm -hmm. eating the food, Dr. Now drops the Smell pizza the box and Smell points the, breath, the finger of truth. He reminds her that she hasn't lost any weight since day one. In fact, she's gained about 50 pounds. Bro, if you gain weight in the hospital, you can't be saved. Kick her out. She's cooked. He also informs She's her that cooked. he knows about the secret burgers, too. Yeah, and her clever that. scheme of hiding the evidence in another patient's trash. Oh, of God. course, Shanae nice, denies yeah? that she's been eating junk. And she even hilariously says at one point that she hasn't been eating anything at all. Okay, pizza lover. So you're telling me all that weight is a fat suit, huh? Let me guess, you waiting till GTA 6 to lose weight, huh? Come on, nah! I ain't eat nothing at all? She's making things up to try Clearly. to avoid accountability. Clearly. On top of that, the staff has seen her eating burgers and pizza and that Freddy sick. has been sneaking in. Hey, Shanae, see what I found. You should have just ate the pizza box too, honestly. Honestly. Since you can't hide right. evidence, eat that the evidence. Freddy. Shanae. The lying need to stop now. Okay, Shanae? Please stop lying. Here's the situation. Okay. Matter of fact, smell her breath. Smell Freddie's breath, smell her breath, and you tell me, Doc, which one got the pizza breath? For four months that I have seen you from day one, you haven't lost any weight. Four months? <laughs> Bro, After Jian's initial weigh-in at 702 pounds, Dr. Now tries to Wait, get an idea. After Jian's initial weigh-in at 702 pounds. Ugh, 700 pounds of yacht? Backshot win would have blew me away. Dr. Now tries oh. to get an idea of her activity and diet, and he immediately gives her the side eye when she claims that she doesn't eat lunch. She also claims that Oh yeah, that's right, she eats brunch, huh? <laughs> Let me guess, she just be eating the brunch, huh? After dinner, she doesn't eat anything else but an orange. Orange what? Cheetos? Cause I know you're not talking about fruit, shawty. Like, why all y'all keep lying to me? I, I won't know. Keep in know. mind, this is like directly she, after oh, we she, seen. Oh, she busting down. Hold on, hold but on. But an look, look, orange. Look, look, look. Keep in mind. Oh, she busting down that water burger, ain't it? This is what like is that? Popeyes. What? What? What other restaurants is orange? Directly after we seen is her orange, she talking stuffing about the her face her with a burger and a ton of sausages. So. Her mother then gets questioned and lists off some relatively healthy sounding things, like what? including again, lots of oranges. Bro, I'm to, bro, I'm, I almost broke my setup again. <laughs> I'm not going to bang it, bro. Where are the oranges she talking about? I know she might be built like an orange, but what oranges are? Y'all don't got oranges in y'all house. We mysteriously 
never see anyone eat during the entire episode. Sada ate like so I watched this whole episode and I did not see <laughs> one orange. Let me Later stop, on during the weigh in, oh, when Jeanne finds out that she's gained 30 pounds, she claims it's due to going over the 1200 calories on just one day. One day but or if you really days. think about it, that would have to be a cheat day of about 100,000 calories. Crazy part is, bro, I feel like she did. Matter of fact, hey, she telling the truth, bro. She had a 100K cheat day, bro. So, I believe it. Yeah, I believe Jan, it. You're if lying. She wanna, if she, Here's a clip. She telling the truth. She right. She had a 100K calorie cheat day. the remaining 50 pounds in six weeks on your own to get down to your overall goal I gave you. But instead, you gained back 29 pounds. Yes. Can you tell me what so happened? I had a, 50 I had a day that bag. I went over the 1,200 calories. <laughs> So one you bad day and you so gained serious. 30 pounds? I, Is that what you're telling me now? You're both lying. And you don't plan on changing. Mm -mm. You still plan to make excuses and hope I believe you. And just give you the surgery. Yes, I'm motivated to do it. I was motivated yeah. then to do it. Damn, and then what happened? About discipline, what so went I, wrong? I'll tell you what went wrong, bro. So you ran out of oranges and had to order DoorDash, bro. But hey, man. It's another video, bro. Called, uh called 600 pound life guests who snuck junk food let me know if y'all want that bro because i feel like i'm gonna make this a part one and if y'all want it bro just let me know let's get this to 100k i said 100k <laughs> i'm thinking about her calories let's get this to 100 likes if y'all want 600 pound life patients who snuck the junk food bro so you know i'm saying so all that being said it's another king's a vid in the books bro and i'm gonna see y'all next one bro it's your boy king's a signing out man peace